On Friday night in London, England, Michael Venom Page wants to be a champion. I've come over, I've got my redemption. Now I want that bling. After the long-awaited rematch with former champion Douglas Lima, Page proved that he was quicker. The speed with which he closes distance is what makes him uber dangerous. More powerful. And had learned from his mistakes. Douglas is a, he's not quite at 100%. Oh! the three inches of difference and why this fight is still going on. For the winner by split decision, MVP! Michael Page will now fight Yaroslav Amazov for the world title. The one and only MVP is back! I already had an inkling that when obviously when Russia and Ukraine the whole thing was kicking off, it's a, it's a, it's a circumstance that I don't think anybody would have either foreseen or could have foreseen or you know anybody's ever really been in before. For me, it's just like I hope he's cool. I hope he's okay when he goes over there. I hope his family's good. I hope everyone's safe over there. And obviously, and he's kind of back at what he does best. With Amazov out of the fight, a new contender stepped forward in Logan Storley. Amazov has a lot going on right now, you know, and so we'll see how long that really sits him out. We, you know, we wish him the best, but uh, I have to take care of MVP first, and then we'll see, what's, we'll see what's after that. In his last fight, we saw a five round war against one of the most established family names in all of MMA. He and Gracie are just looking to put it on each other, knowing the stakes. Guys, he looks absolutely amazing. And he gets backed up by Storm. Oh, he's in trouble. I think it opened a lot of people's eyes to what I'm capable of on my feet. You know, throwing 400 strikes. So I think they saw definitely a different version of me that they've never seen. And having previously fought the champion, Storley looks to avenge his only loss and claim the Bellator gold. He knows, you know, how difficult that fight was for both of us and how close that fight was. So I'm, uh, I'm excited for that rematch. On Friday night, two of the most dominant fighters in the welterweight division will do battle and get one step closer to a world championship belt. He knows he's in for a fight. He's in with a different type of guy that he's ever fought before. I still don't feel like Logan is anywhere near the, the, the striking level, so that's just not even going to be uh, uh, a martial arts conversation in the cage. <laughs> so I know you, you have to be focused for 25 minutes when you fight him, and you have to know you're going to get frustrated and he's not going to stay in that typical fighting range. Tune in to Bellator 281, Michael Page versus Logan Storley. I'm going to be myself. I'm just going to be furious. I'm going to be dominating. I'm going to be exceptional. So I'm coming to be at the top. If Storley, in an alternate universe, was to be able to beat me, it's because, damn, he's really good. Because I'm amazing. <laughs> <laughs>